Cheers is filmed before a live studio audience. Fraser Candy, I apologize for interrupting what should be the most important moment in a person's life. But I'm compelled to do this by my affection and respect for both of you. Isn't it possible that in the heat of recent events, you might be confusing physical attraction for deeper, more sublime emotions. You know, in the psychiatric profession, we have a statement for that little theory of yours. Ha! <laughs> Fraser! You have to admit, you and Candy are as different as night and day. You are as different as Sam and I. Fraser, hear me out. We were, as you are, diametrically opposed personalities. Oh, at first, our differences were charming to us. I found Sam's lack of refinement and sophistication crudely provocative. Yeah, and I, um, I like the way her hair smelled. I'm sure, in addition, you were excited by the intellectual vistas to which I exposed you? Uh, no, I really think it was that conditioner. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I thought I was getting better. Fraser, sit down. You keep saying you're getting better, but I haven't seen any evidence of it. Now, hard as it may be, you've got to stop being preoccupied with me. Get a hold of yourself. Enough said. You don't have to hit Fraser Crane over the head. Unless, of course, you'd like to. <laughs> Where is your sense of humor? Great. <laughs> Listen, it's been a long time since I went out and raised a little help. What do you say you and I go out and get crazy? You know, a couple of guys giving the women of Boston their best shot? Well, this is a pity offer, isn't it? Basically. OK. <laughs> Might be just what the doctor ordered. You know, rattle my cage a little. All right, that's a ticket. Listen, I got a few things to do for a while. So why don't you just sit down here and be a good little boy, and Sammy Claus will take you out later and get your tree trimmed. <laughs> hey, Frazier. I'm ready if you are. Oh, wonderful. Let's begin our evening of revelry. All right. Now, listen. I want to get one thing straight. Tonight, I want to hear one word about Diane Chambers, OK? We're going to get out there and get your mind on some more pleasant things. Agreed. Uh, where are we going? Well, I think first thing we need is some female companionship. I know a couple of the hot spots. So why don't we just mosey along here? Oh, let me uh... Let me uh, tell you how this evening's going to go here. Now, we're going to probably walk into some really nice little spot there. You're going to see a, a beautiful woman across the room. I mean, hot, sexy, a woman you dream about. All right, now, her friend is for you. All right? Keith, how'd you like to arm wrestle me for a beer? Hey, all right. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, but I have to warn you, I was arm wrestling champion of Posey County. Yeah, fair <laughs> enough. All right. One, two, three. Wow. <laughs> well, ladies and gents, the new champ of Posey yeah. County. <laughs> All right, who's next? Hey, whoa, Ooh, who's next? Not me. Uh, huh? You look like you could give me a run for my money. I think I'll uh, take a rain check. Come on, man, just for the sport of it. Jack. Look. I'll, I'll buy you the beer. You don't have to beat everybody in the bar. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> what makes you think I'm going to lose? Sam Malone here. I'm the owner of the bar, and I've yet to lose a beer in it. Well, there's a first time for everything. One, two, three. <laughs> so, how long are you in town for? <laughs> Just for the day, I'm on my way to the air races in Reno. Reno, yeah, that's, that's lovely this time of year. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess I owe you a beer here. Yeah. Diane, how the hell are you? Oh. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> my God, you look pale. You folks should have seen her frolicking in a surf at Mykonos. Her little bottom was as brown as a berry. <laughs> the stick running around buck naked. Was a semi-private beach? Used to be a semi-private bottom. <laughs> I think we're getting the hang of this, Sam. Yeah. 
Yeah. Feeling pretty powerful, huh? Well, I have to admit, I kind of feel like I own the sky. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jack is really something, isn't he? <laughs> You're kidding me. Oh, yeah. I could do all that macho stuff if I wanted to, but it wouldn't make me any more of a man. Do I detect a hint of raised consciousness? Mm, yeah. I mean, a real guy doesn't have to jump on sharks and dodge poison darts just to prove he's a guy. Astonished. Uh, real guy just has to score heavy with the babes, that's all. <laughs> Diane? I gotta compliment you on the way you handle Fraser. Man, that was, that was pretty good. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I hate to see a man and woman make a mistake. Mm -hmm. Fraser, Fraser and Ken. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, uh, no, no, I mean, you, you gotta hang out with somebody for a long time. You gotta really get to know them before you take a big step like that. Yes. If something's worthwhile, it's worth waiting for. Absolutely. Well, a lot of people out there waiting for a wedding and no bride, no groom. I guess it's up to us, huh? My God, Sam. I can't believe my ears. You're serious, aren't you? Oh. Oh, no, no. I, I just meant that we should go out there and serve those people some drinks. That, that's all. Oh, that's what I meant, too. No, it isn't. <laughs> what do you think I was talking about? Come on. Well, for a moment there, I confess, I thought you were talking about something else. Uh-huh. And what would your answer be? Oh, no, Sam. <laughs> That's the sort of question that has to be asked before it can be answered. Well, if I heard the answer, maybe it would be easier for me to ask the question. <laughs> Very well. The answer is no. Well, then, the question was, have you ever met a man who gave you the hots more than me? I'd like to change my answer. Fine, fine, fine. Then the answer is yes. Well, then the question was, do you want to go to bed with me? I want to change my answer again. Well, that's okay, and I'll change my question, too. Uh, is there any way that you would not object to not going to bed with me? Wait a minute. <laughs>